Hi and welcome. I hope you are good. Uh, this video is about how to install and uh, load a package in R. So if you are uh, just starting with R and you are you have installed R in R Studio, so most probably the next step you would like to do is to install a package in R. So I have written down uh, some of the methods here to install a package in R. So first is the option one that is uh, using code. Uh, this is the one which I prefer to use. And the second option there is is to uh, install a package using the user interface in R Studio or in R. Uh, so I'll I'll start uh, with the option one. Uh, I'll open R Studio. So basically, you what you have to do is uh, you have to run the code install dot uh, packages. I'll just zoom in install dot packages, and you have to uh, give the package name. Now uh, please note that when you are installing. So you have to put the package name in double quotes or in single quotes. For example, uh, if I have to install the package called ggplot2, ggplot2 is a, a package for it's a, it's an awesome uh, package for data visualization. Uh, so I have to put install dot packages in double quotes or in single quotes ggplot2. Similarly, if I have to install a package called tidyr. So the command which I need to run is install dot packages uh, in quotes tidy art and the next step would be to load the package. So let's start with installing these packages. I'll first install and load uh, ggplot2. So I hope the size is so can increase the bit, size a bit more. Okay, uh, so ins install dot packages in quotes. You can either use, sing use, use single quotes or double quotes. So ggplot2. So you just need to press control enter. Okay, so it's installing. Okay, so it has successfully installed. And uh, as I mentioned here, to load the package. Now, once the package, package package is installed, we need to load the package using library package name command. Now, uh, this is a little bit weird, but while, while loading the package, you don't have to use uh, double quotes or single quotes. So while loading a package, name should be in, uh, should not be in quotes. So we have to write library ggplot2. So uh, the package is loaded. Uh, similarly, if we want to install the package called uh, tidyr, So install dot packages in double quotes tidy r okay so it says package tidy r successfully unpacked uh, and md5 sums checked so again to load uh, the the package you we need to give library tidy r so uh, the tidy r package is loaded uh one more uh, just a hint if suppose you want to know something about the package you can use the command library help equal to in quotes ggplot2 so it will give you some information about the package uh, for example what is the version that was installed who is the auth who are the authors so basically it was created by hardly Wickham and team at our studio and uh, it will also show some of the uh, functions which it which which they have yeah like uh, aes and all those things uh, what are the different arguments in the function ggplot 
so it it gives you uh, uh, gives some details about uh, what the package is similarly if i give help equal to tidy r so it will give some details about the tidy r package okay so now that both the packages are installed now as i showed this was the option one that using the code we can install a package now moving on to the option two using the user interface in our in our studio or our, i'll be using our studio so to install a package in our studio through user interface i'll just uh, once read through go to the pane uh, we need to go to the pane uh, files plots packages help and viewer uh, which is on the bottom right in our studio so this is the uh, this is the window here you need to go to the pane packages okay and click on the tab packages uh, which i have already clicked click on the pack tab, tab name packages and click on install you'll have to click on install now let's install uh, the two packages the one of the packages is leaflet another is nha nes so let's search for the leaflet package so click on install so either you let's type it l e f l e f l so this will uh, now one advantage of using a user interface is it will show you the uh, show you all the options of packages which start with the name for example right now i have typed l e a f l so all the packages are listed so i want this one so i need to click on install so see it, it is also giving the same code so it will install the package if you are looking on the uh, left bottom left console okay it is installing now all the dependencies okay so now the leaflet package is installed now th this was to install the package the second step is to load the package okay to load the package what you need to do is you need to either scroll down to search for the leaflet package here which is a bit tidy uh, not tidy tedious it's a leaflet uh, so a better option would be to search for the package which you have already installed and it will come up and you just need to click on leaflet to load the package so clicking on this checkbox uh, the package will will be loaded now let's look at the second package which we wanted to, which we wanted to install nha nes now if i look at the installed packages this name will not be there see it's not there now uh, to install it we'll again go to we'll click on install and we'll type nha nes okay so we'll install it so again it is doing under the hood installed at packages nha nes so the package is installed now 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 if we search for nha yes it will show up now we can click and the package is loaded we'll try with the one more package installing one more package and uh, let's do it through uh, through the user interface itself it's a tidy text click install now this is a very good uh, uh, package for natural language processing in r if you have not used it you can try it Okay, so let's just search for tidy text and when we click on it it loads if we if we unclick on this this will this will detach uh, this will detach the package from the you know, from the environment so the so these were the two methods of installing packages in r first was to use uh, the option using you uh, 
to install it using code and the second option was using uh, the user interface in our studio i personally use uh, do it using code uh, but you can still try using the user interface itself also so this was a video about how to install packages in r uh, thanks a lot uh, i hope it was useful take care